Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial on Canva. Before we get started, make sure to smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime I upload new videos. So, let's jump straight into CANVA Canva. So, you know, I saw a design, okay, and I just want you to know, I saw a template design and, you know, on Canva and I was like, wow. It just struck me so much and I decided to recreate it and I was able to do it okay and there's the whole design just that there was no text here and you know I added my things in the line and I made my own adjustment and stuff and I love it and I just want to show you how I did this uh, how I designed this in Canva sorry I, I know I'm just super excited that's why I you know when you're excited sometimes you just mess up so yeah let me just show you quickly so 1920 <laughs> I forgot this is not after effects, you know, but I've got some after effect tutorials you can check out, you know, so that's just by the way. So, um, create a custom dimension, you know, your custom dimension, but I'm going with 1080 by 1350, create design, then it opens up and, uh, okay. Oh, so we saw it. Oh. Uh, okay so this is you know this is what i saw and it struck me so hard if you want to use it you can just go ahead but i want us to recreate this okay it just struck me so hard and i was like wow let me just recreate it okay so i choose my design and so my color i want to increase this now i'll come to element okay i'll come to i'll just choose the line and i'll go with this okay so this is what i'm going to do i'm just going to play with the lines so this okay and yeah so control v control c then i rotate it 90 degrees okay and i come to put it here but you know it's not perfect so what i'll do is i'll just increase yeah and i'll move this okay i think one okay this is perfect and i'll just reduce the uh, you know what i'm talking about yeah i just reduce i'll control c control v and i'll rotate again to negative 90 oh negative 90 okay then i'll move this here okay and I'll zoom in because I want to get I want to be accurate so yeah okay so you know this how to achieve the line I, I, you get it so this how to achieve the line so that's it then you select all and you group so that it becomes one whole thing you can just move around okay so I can increase the size of this and position it you know maybe somewhere here uh, I don't know why I keep struggling with uh-huh then what I'll do is just press T T for T cup okay for the shortcuts you know the text to use the text so I'll just um, select all and I would use I would say achieve you know for the sake of this tutorial A C H I E V E achieve and I'm going to use my favorite okay I wouldn't use my favorite font here I'll just okay so this this is what I want to do I want to make the text a bit bigger okay then so I can know how I'm going to bend and stuff so what I can do is uh, a c h uh, okay let me just undo oh come on how can this anyway a c h okay and i make it bigger a bit bigger then let me just ungroup this okay and stretch then select all group simple so a c h and then um, control v control c and how this will achieve again is it h i e okay no i want a capital e okay so e 
Okay, then I would rotate this. Okay, so that's the whole trick. Because when I saw it, I was like, what? How was this made? You know, and IE, then control C, control V, V, E. Okay. Then I'll just rotate this one like this, which is beautiful. So we made our own in Canva. Okay, and I think it's too much to the. Okay, so we just move it here. And I think we have. Let me just group the whole thing. Oh, where's the group? No. All these things should. We should be able to group them. Anyway, if it can't be grouped, I'll just select. Anyway, let me just select all and move it up. Okay, so something awesome like this achieved, and you know if you want, like I did, I just came to add some text. So Control C and Control V. As simple as that, you know. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. That was my, that was my cell phone. Okay, yeah. So, you know. This, you know, like I was saying, this isn't my original idea. I saw it and it struck a chord in me and I just decided to recreate it. And after I recreated it, I was like, why not just create a tutorial on how to recreate that? Yeah. You know, yeah. So, Ctrl-C, Ctrl-V, then maybe you can come to say, in inspired, okay. In inspired by Canva. Okay, so that you know, just to okay, you know, just to show that it was a template you saw and struck your chord, or if you want to, you know, it's a free template, so you can just go ahead and use it in your design. But wow, this is it, and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. I know this is the shortest tutorial I've ever made, but I'm glad I've been able to make a very short tutorial. And the name is Benjamin. I have some interesting posts that you'd love and some interesting things I have on Instagram. So you can check me out at African Geeks. Okay, and uh, you can message me. Let's connect. Let's you know. Let's, let's show some love. You know, like show some love. And before I go, try as much as possible to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime anytime i upload new videos so the name is benjamin and i'll see you in my next video